In addition to voting decidedly for Barack Obama for president, early polls showed California set to overturn same-sex marriage Tuesday, though that race was almost too close to call. We'll definitely prop a, um, I think a no is very important. Because it goes against my personal religion. So. You might vote no on a, yeah. Of all the California ballot initiatives, perhaps none was more charged than Proposition 8, which would constitutionally ban gay marriage, particularly here in San Francisco, where an estimated 25 to 30 percent of the population is gay. Aside from Prop 8, an initiative under the national microscope, Californians voted largely with their pocketbooks, shooting down about half of the 12 initiatives on the ballot, namely the expensive ones. Hours after the polls closed, the race was too tight to call on a $10 billion bond measure for a high-speed train connecting San Francisco and Los Angeles. But Californians did defeat almost $2 billion in bonds for two criminal justice-related propositions, though they did vote to fund a billion-dollar bond for low-cost mortgages for veterans. Californians voted resoundingly against two clean energy initiatives, both of which were opposed by environmentalists and the clean tech community. So in general, the renewable energy and the clean tech community are strongly in favor of RPSs. Uh, this RPS, though, as it's written, has lots of problems with it. And, and, and so it's, it's where against how it's being executed and proposed and not against the actual idea of it. Another highly charged proposition, Prop 2, which met plenty of opposition from farmers and businesses, passed overwhelmingly. Prop 2, led by the Humane Society, will require farmers to provide space for animals to move around more freely in cages by 2015. In an election where the economy played an important role, it was no different in California, a state that faces about an $8 billion budget shortfall. In San Francisco, I'm Stacey Delo.